So Jack, I'm going to do some. Uh, I'm going to do uh, something kind of strange with you, and it involves uh, making a prediction of what's going to happen in the future. Right. Now, I have in my pocket, inside my shirt, I have a prediction of something I think is going to happen in the not too distant future. I'm going to have you think of any word in the world, any word in the English language. Can you think of that word? Yeah. If I told you I had that word predicted, written down inside my shirt, would that be good? That would be pretty good. Name that word. Volcano. Volcano. I couldn't have known that, could I? No. Nope. So if I had volcano printed, printed, printed in my pocket, would that be good? That'd be pretty good. I have, because uh, inside my shirt, I actually have um, <clears throat> <laughs> the Collins Encyclopedia Dictionary and uh, Theosaurus in colour, because everybody needs a colour dictionary, and uh, Volcano will be in there. So there you go. I predicted the word that you would think of. Thank you. That's what the fucking small is that book? It's not the size that counts. It's how many words are in it, Jack. You need I to don't remember. remember either. <laughs> yeah, don't you don't need to. It's boring. It uh, doesn't really have much of a plot or a story. But anyway, it's not important. Uh, that will become important later on, though. So hold on to the dictionary. I do have a real prediction. That was a joke, but I do have a real prediction. That was a mental lap. No, this is, this is a real prediction. Um, and any good mentalist, and I'm a mentalist now, Michael. <laughs> shut up, I am. Is it? I'm a, shut up, I am. I'm a mentalist now. I'm a mentalist. I'm, I'm growing a sideburns, and I'm going to have a widow's peak. <laughs> Kind of wearing a black suit, it's going to be amazing. I'm going to be like all mysterious and everything and start talking about NLP. Yeah, I'm a mentalist now. But anyway, uh, most mentalists will give you the prediction halfway through. I'm giving it you at the beginning. This is my prediction. Take it, hold it, love it, don't open it. Thank you. Um, so, I went to the shops the other day, right. as is my want and desire and need, and I found these in, uh, in a little uh, new agey shop. And what they are, I don't know if you've ever heard of them before. Have you ever heard of these? These? And I'll give you a clue, Jack. They're not playing cards. Put Pac-Man on the back. No, 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 no. They're, that's just a back design. What they are, and this is what's really interesting, <coughs> uh, they're meant to be motivational playing cards. I know what you're thinking. How can playing cards motivate you? Well, these are playing cards with different um, words on them, basically. So you can see the playing cards. Like, that's a five of hearts. That's a four of diamonds. You know, they're, they're, they are... They are playing cards, but as well as being playing cards, they have words. And all of these words are designed to be positive words that are meant to inspire you. So the whole idea is that if you're feeling a little bit down, you go, oh, trust. Now I feel a lot better. Uh, it's also got numbers on. The That's how it works. It's also got numbers on here as well. But I realise because there's cards, there's numbers, there's words, um, I can actually use these to read minds. So we'll start off with something simple, because let's face it, Jack, you are simple. So we'll start off with something simple. I'm going to go back and forth. Well, you do it. Go back and forth with your finger. Uh, and any time you want to, what I want you to do, when you feel the urge, just stop. Although if you felt the urge, why would you stop? That's probably the oldest joke in magic, by the way, just so you know. Uh, put your finger down. On, is that where you at? Yeah. You, you, you're happy there? Okay, you can move your finger. I'm not that good. Um, have a look at the word on that card. Okay. Can I show the camera? Uh, yeah, it's up to you if you want to. And then put it back. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> see if I, I was going to start with something really simple. You're closed off, you see, your arms are folded, but I think I can do this. Think of the word. Think of the word. Imagine it's here. Think of the first letter of the word. Imagine that word is shining really brightly in front of you. Like Minority Report. Remember Minority Report? You're seeing it in front of you. I'm seeing it reverse. So if I flip it around, yeah, that first word, it's a H. Letter, first letter's a H, isn't it? It is a H. Yeah. Think of a letter in the middle of the word. Oh, you went back and forth, didn't you? You were thinking between like an M and an O. Yeah. Yeah, you ended up on the O. Uh, think of a letter at the end. It's a Y. The word you're thinking of is harmony. It was, yeah. It was. Now that's just, you know, like just, just the starting point. <coughs> We're going to go one step further, Jack. We're going to go one step further because I'm going to try and take this to the next level. Are you ready to have this taken to the next level? What is the next level? The next level is for me to cut the deck into two piles. Right. Okay. And then what I want you to do is I want you to take this pile and cut it into two. Very good. And take this pile and cut it into two. Very good. Very good. Now flip one of those piles over. It's up to you. You're making all the decisions here. Flip one of them over. That one there? Yep. And flip one of these over. And I'm telling you what, what's going to happen here. So I'm going to, whatever's face down here, I'm going to shuffle into the face up back and over here. Okay. So you're happy? Do you want to change them around a bit or are you okay? I'll stick with that. Okay. So these two are going to get shuffled together like this. And that's not one of those TV magic shuffles. You can see they really are shuffled. And likewise, when I said when I said put it in half, you, it's fine. It's okay. It's my fault. I shouldn't have picked you. Um, we'll shuffle these together like this as well. Now, take either one of these piles, 
and flip it over. That one there, you sure? Yep. <clears throat> Perfect, so we can shuffle these into these. Happy? Sure. Happy. <laughs> Happy. You got it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to look away. Okay. And we'll spread them out. Some of the cards are face up, some of the cards are face down. I'm going to look away. When yeah. I do, you're going to take any one of the face down cards. Right. Take it out, look at it, but don't show the camera. Don't show anyone else and then put it there. Okay. When you've done that, tell me, and then you're going to flip all of the cards over. And you're going to take any four face down cards without looking at them and put them on top of that card. Right. Do you understand? I think so. Good. I will look away. So start off. Any face down card. Take it out. You got one? I'm just getting it now. Look at it, but don't show anyone else. Okay. Put it in the corner of the mat now. Pick the cards up and turn them over. And then spread them out and take any four face down cards. And put them on top of that card. My well, let's look at them. Nope, you're not going to. I only want you to know that one card. Okay. You done? Yeah, like. Take your time. You're doing great. Are we good? Yep. So we took any four face down cards? Yep. Great, we're just going to. You mix those up face down so nobody knows what they are. I will uh, sort these all out so they're facing the right way. That's important. Uh. And I wish I could do this by magic. If I could, that would be a real triumph, but uh, it's not possible, unfortunately. I'm a mentalist now. <laughs> Shut up. Why do you keep if saying I, that? Because I am a mentalist now. If I name's Stebbins. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, that's all you give those a shuffle. Apparently, that's all you have to do to be a mentalist. <laughs> no Stebbins. Uh, no, I'm a, I'm a mentalist now. If I was a magician, I could have sorted them out, but I'm not. I have to be all cool and mysterious. That's what I am now, Jack. I'm cool and mysterious. It's very exciting. Well, I was just late at night. Exactly. Right, so, um, <clears throat> you mix these up as well. Did you shuffle these as well? Yeah. Okay. And one of these, you don't know the, um, you don't know the words, do you? Other than one of them, no. You know one of them, okay. And you mix them up and you shuffle them and nobody can know anything. Is that fair? Yep. Okay. Michael, what I want you to do, there's five cards. You're going to try and find his card yourself. You're going to give me a number between, say, I don't know, five and 50. Whatever number you give me, I'm going to go back and forth, counting one card at a time until I get to your number. Okay. okay. So give me a number. What do you want? 16. 16. Are you sure you want 16? Yeah. Okay. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Yeah. Now, think about this. You took out a card. You looked at it. You only showed it yourself. Yeah. You then took another four cards. You don't know what they are. You then mixed them up, and we just laid them down on the table. He then gave me a number. He ended up on this card. One number less would have been this card. One number more would have been this card. But he ended up on this one right there. First of all, Jack, was your card honest? No. No. Was your card harmony? No. Was your card success? No. Was your card trust? No. Wow. Which means this must be your card. Michael, it's amazing, but let me see if I can do this. Do you remember the word, Jack? I do. Let me just engage mentalism mode. <laughs> Shut up, I'm a mentalist now. Hang on. Hum, hum. Was your word, no, it just hit me. Was your word mission? It was. The one that Michael found. Pretty Isn't good. Isn't that amazing? That it's pretty, pretty good. good. That's freaking incredible, man. I could start a religion with that. It wouldn't be a very good religion, but I could start a religion. All right? It'd be a religion based on lies, but it's fine. It would be a religion. We're going to go one step further. We're going to go one step further. We're going to do one more thing, if that's okay with you. Sure. We're, you mixed these mm. cards up, didn't you? Can you do me a favor and cut them out mm. halfway? It's up to you where, but around about half. Because apparently, to you, half is five cards, but whatever. Uh, turn them face up. And put them back on top of the pack. Very good. And you cut to mission again. I'd like to claim that that was on purpose. It was. It was on purpose. As a mentalist, you should claim everything. That was me. I did that. I yeah, whatever. We're gonna take the. <laughs> we're gonna take the uh, the four face down cards. Right. Without looking at them. <coughs> okay. Yeah. And we'll try and do this. We'll try and do this. We won't even use the rest of them. <sighs> Sharpie marker time. Put your hand on there. Top 
card. You shuffle them, you cut to four random cards. Yeah. Okay, have a peek at the top card. Just have a peek at the word on the top card and then put it back. Okay. Okay. Send it to me, Jack. Send it to me. What, send me, the, send, me send me that no that send it to me. Yeah, to transfer yourself into me. The so <laughs> no, no, really, <laughs> seriously, think of the word. Okay, there's four letters, isn't there? There is four letters. Are you playing fucking hangman? No, I know there's four letters. <laughs> Think of the last letter. There's an E. There is an E. There's an F. There is an F. There's an L. There is. There's an I. The first word is life. It is. Turn it over, just the first one, and show them. Oh my God. I am a man amongst <laughs> men. It's like, I'm 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 like uh, Max Maven reincarnated. Let's see if we can do it again. <laughs> Shut up, I'm a mentalist now, all right? Let me do the next one. Think of the word. I have a Okay. Think of the amount of letters. Oh, you looked up and to the left. That tells me that you were thinking about how many letters there were. You didn't do that with life. Because you didn't do it with life and you did it with that, that tells me it's a longer word because you had to think through how many letters were there. Is that right? Now you're blinking quite quickly. You, you, you're trying to hide the fact that I know it's eight letters. It's eight letters, isn't it? I think so. Yeah, it is. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Which letter would you like me to get first? Well, I can't tell you that. One to eight. Which one? Uh, five. That's that one. Um... Concentrate on it, send it to me. Oh, he looked up into the left again. He's trying to write, okay, it's a V. And it also means that uh, your mom has a gammy leg. Is that right? My mom has a gammy yeah, leg? Yeah, she's got a bit of a leg problem at the moment, isn't it? Don't worry, Jack, she'll get pretty, better. Pretty sure she no, does she, No, she does. She's not telling you because she doesn't want to worry you, but she'll get better, I promise. Which letter would you like me to go for next? Two. Two. Concentrate, concentrate. No, don't send me that. I don't want to know what you did last week. Not that bit, the other bit. Lock that away. Got it. It's a no. Am I right? It is a no. Let's go for the first letter, shall we? Let's go nuts. Think of it. 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 Think of something you like drinking, beginning with that same letter. <gasps> you were thinking of milk, weren't you? Because it's an M. Oh my God, this is amazing. Let's go for another one. Let's go for a letter at the end. There's an E, is that right? It is right. Let's go for this one. It's a T. It's an I. It's an A. It's a T. You ended up with motivator. Am I right? You are right. I... Honestly, honestly, let's go for this one. Okay. <sighs> Concentrate. <clears throat> Does your word is it made up of over ten thousand letters? Well, I'm pretty sure no words over 10,000 letters. Is, is your word made up of over 10,000 letters? I'm going to say no. I'm getting five, three, nine, two, three. Is your word made up of 53,923 letters? Uh, no. You know what? I know what this means. This happens sometimes when you're a mentalist like me. Because well, my mentalist, you're going now, right? No, 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 no. This happens sometimes when you're a mentalist, right? Because what happens is you can look for patterns. Some word. Have you heard of an ambigram? It's a word. It's a letters or numbers. And when you turn it around, it looks completely different. You see, you're looking at fifty-three thousand nine hundred twenty-three. But if I turn this around, do you know what it looks like? It looks like a word. No, it doesn't. It looks like total bollocks. Um, <laughs> It okay, can't be that then. Hang on, fifty-three thousand, fifty-three thousand nine hundred twenty-three. Does that word mean anything to you? you, you were you thinking <laughs> earlier? Word, it's a number. <laughs> ah, I know it. Uh, the, the, how many? How many? How, what did you eat for breakfast this morning? What up for breakfast? Mm -hmm. I ain't. What? I'm fasting up the minute, so I didn't have any breakfast. You didn't have any breakfast. <laughs> okay, that can't be it then. What did your mom have for breakfast this morning before she sorted the pajama leg out? <laughs> I think she had cereal. Cereal. Did she have cornflakes? No, I think she had granola. Granola? Yeah. Did she have 53,923 <laughs> pieces of granola? If she had a massive bowl, probably. <laughs> I got it, Jack! It's not one big number, it's three numbers. 539, 2 and 3. That makes sense, doesn't it, Jack? Does he? Yeah, it does, mate. Let me explain. I think he's lost it, Michael. <laughs> have you looked at the next word? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've got it. At the beginning, I gave you a dictionary. You did? 
A dictionary has lots of numbers in it, and uh, sorry, lots of words. Each page has two columns, the first column and the second column, and then it's got lots of words going down each column in bold, and then it tells you what the word means. Yeah. Pick up the dictionary I gave you at the beginning. Turn to page 539, Michael. Uh, no, you're Jack. <laughs> Sorry, it, all of this information is coming into me at the same time and I'm struggling to comprehend it. I'm a mentalist now. I'm sorry. 539. No more coin tricks for me, I'm re re rehabilitated. Oh, I'm 539, Jack. Go to the second column because we've got a two. That's the second column there, Jack. The yeah. clue is it's the second one along. <laughs> there you go, it's okay. It's my fault, I shouldn't have picked I'm you. I'm already. Okay, and go three down, Jack. And what is on page 539 on the second column? Third down, Jack. Strong. And what was the word, Jack? Strong. Boom! Yes! Oh my God, the mentalism flows through me! What the fuck is going on? This is just amazing, Jack. Oh my God. This is amazing, but the last word. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Never look at it. Because there's a mentalist. I'm a mentalist now, by the way. There's a <laughs> mentalist. I need a big finish. Oh God. Gave you a piece of paper at the beginning. You did? Give me the piece of paper. This piece of paper has a word written on it. It was a word written for the very beginning. I've written in the sales office next to my tidy desk before I came in here. <laughs> Shut up. One of those words isn't true. <laughs> and, and, and I wrote this down and then you shuffled the cards thoroughly over and over again. And then you cut somewhere and you cut. And, and I told you life, I told you motivate. We got to strong eventually. It took us a while, but we got there. <laughs> but then this one right there, that card. This word being written down from the very beginning. One word, one word only. Jack, the word is love. Oh, shit, the bottle's just gone. The word is love, Jack. Bottle's not made that's gone. <laughs> this is the moment. This is the big finish. This is the sort of shit that Matt Cluley wishes he could do. <laughs> this is mentalism done well, Jack. Love, L-O-V-E, the strongest emotion in the entire world. And Jack, right over here. You had one card from the shuffle deck and you cut to it yourself. And Jack, that word is love. Hey. Oh my God. Okay. You've seen a lot of magic, but be honest. This is the most amazing thing you've ever seen in your entire life. And do you know why? Because you're a mentalist. I'm a mentalist now.